So um, my name is Kayla and I've been using oils for about two years now. Um, I got started when my son was about six months old and he had a lot of respiratory issues as a kid, um, constantly had RSV and croup. And so I got into essential oils to help build up his immune system. Um, I also found emotional health for myself and was able um, to d better deal with my emotional health and just become more stress-free um, and just to live a better life. So I started selling essential oils about a year ago um, because I became so passionate about them. People were asking questions, so I decided I would just make um, some extra money off of it. Um, so I just went to the YL Fall Symposium last week, and on Saturday, Dr. Minky talked about a wellness strategy. Um, he talked about how in college, when he was younger, he was battling a terminal illness and was not given a very good prognosis. So he had been through lots of um, treatments for this illness and wasn't really getting much better. So he decided instead of focusing on the illness that he was just gonna focus on wellness. <laughs> so he developed a wellness strategy and basically it's three components. Uh, number one, he said, stop poisoning yourself. And the number one toxin found in the common household is actually artificial fragrances. Um, so that's going to be candles, soaps, fabric softeners, perfumes, etc. So that's the number one toxin that we come into contact on a daily basis. And he said just stop poisoning yourself. Uh, and number two, he said to flood the body with nutrients. Um, so that's with food, you know, eating healthy organic food, um, eating vegetables, and just getting a really rich diet. Essential oils are a great way to get nutrients in the body as well. Um, they're very high in antioxidants, especially the citrus oils, very high in limonene, um, very good for the immune system. And essential oils have the ability to cross the blood-brain barrier, so they're really going to penetrate into the cell and provide the body the nutrients it needs. Uh, and then he said number three is to manage your stress level. And we do that um, through essential oils. They help us to manage our stress level um, by diffusing and breathing them in aromatically. They can cross the blood-brain barrier and they're able to help reduce our stress level. They also help with emotional health and well-being um, and just smelling things gets the olfactory system of the brain and can help boost your mood. So essential oils are volatile compounds. They are distilled or pressed from plants. Um, they've been around for thousands of years and they have been used for cosmetic purposes as well as spiritually and emotionally uplifting. We have a question from a, an audience yes. member. What is the blood-brain barrier? Um, so basically the blood-brain barrier is going to be the barrier between your blood and your brain. So your brain is going to sense something's wrong. It's going to send signals to help fix that issue. Um, when you take pharmaceutical drugs, the reason it's just masking symptoms is because it cannot cross that blood-brain barrier. So it's not actually getting into the brain to tell the brain, hey, um, we're fixing this problem. Um, essential oils have the ability to cross that barrier so they can go directly to the brain. Basically, that's what the blood-brain barrier is. Um, so that's why they're so powerful because they, unlike um, pharmaceuticals, they can actually cross that barrier and help the root of the issue. So um, essential oils are also extracted through steam distillation and through cold pressing. Uh, the purest essential oils are far more powerful than botanicals and herbs that are found in the drugstores. Anytime that you hold a bottle of essential oils, you are holding nature's pure essence. Some characteristics of pure essential oils are that they can quickly penetrate the tissues of the skin. They also contain some of the most powerful antioxidants and are determined by the ORAC test provided by Test University. And your body can also benefit in several ways. They can enhance mood, so support overall wellness, uh, maintain healthy body systems, promote relaxation, and much more. Essential oils contain many constituents, including sesquiterpenes, and they have the ability to cross the blood-brain barrier. Um, quality counts when we talk about essential oils. Um, for over 20 years, Young Living has set the standard for purity and excellence. We carefully monitor the production of our oils from the beginning um, the seed, and through the end, the seal. We have a unique seed to seal process that we guarantee ensuring the purity of each oil and protecting nature's living energy in every bottle. We also have a scientific advisory board who um, is constantly coming out with new products and researching our products. 
And this organization has the most prominent scientific authorities available. They're from around the globe and they unite years of experience in uh, alternative therapy. And our council also has unmatched leadership and expertise and they share the world's passion for essential oils. We are redefining the way that essential oils uh, and the world thinks about wellness. And just some safety tips, um, never use them in the eyes and the ears. If you, for some reason, get essential oils in your eyes or your ears, it's not gonna damage them, it will burn. Um, do not flush it with water, water and oils do not mix, so you wanna flood that with a carrier oil, such as olive oil, coconut oil, um, or any kind of fatty oil to help dissolve the essential oil. And if you have any kind of skin sensitivity to oil, if you just put a carrier oil on top, it's going to help that as well. Is there any chance for questions? And only ingest Young Living essential oils. Um, I would not go to Sunflower Shop and get an oil. Um, in fact, if you do, it'll say not for internal use. That is because there are additives in it. So I only suggest ingesting essential oils that are pure. Okay. I'm just going to uh, interrupt you yeah. just for a second. We have a, at least one question over here, and are we going to have time for questions, or can we just yeah, interrupt that's you what as, they're wanting to know as is, we have them? And are you going to put this on YouTube? Yes, this broadcast will be available on my catch, and I'll put it inside the link, and I can send it to whoever wants it. Um, and I can possibly put it to YouTube as well. Uh, and yes, I will have questions at the end, so if you have a question, just um, write it down, and at the end I'll have a Q&A, and I can help answer those too. So just some safety tips. Um, like we said, no ears and eyes, mm -hmm. and uh, use a carrier oil if you have any kind of sensitivity. And also following the label instructions on the bottle is really good. Uh, Young Living mm -hmm. has dilution ratios and all kinds of information directly on the bottle that you can look at. Um, just some ways to use essential oils. You can apply them topically. So you can apply uh, oils directly to the skin or the desired area. Uh, one to three drops of oil is all it takes. They're very potent. Some suggested areas of use are feet, behind the ears, on the wrists, front of the neck, and the base of the skull. And also you can create a homemade bath with Epsom salts and essential oils just for a relaxing bath. Some great oils for that are like lavender and stress away really good for bathing. Um, also, you can layer oils by applying them topically, one on top of another. Um, and then some carrier oil examples, like I said, coconut oil, sweet almond oil, grapeseed oil, um, and olive oil is another good one as well. Um, for children, I always dilute, especially for infants. Um, so do one to two drops of essential oil with a tablespoon of carrier oil. Uh, older children, you can do two to three drops of oil to one teaspoon of carrier oil. And then you can also breathe in the oils aromatically. Um, so you can diffuse them with an the ultrasonic diffuser, and you can also place them in the drop of your hands and cup your hands over your mouth and inhale the oil that way. You can also smell them directly from the bottle, um, or you can place them in cotton balls and vents. So I was actually camping last weekend and forgot to bring my diffuser, so I just put um, some peace and calming on a cotton ball and stuck it in the air vents, and that's a great diffuser that way if you're on the go or in your car, you can put it in a cotton ball and put it in your air vent that way. Um, some tips for diffusing. Make sure you're using an ultrasonic diffuser. Um, if you do have the home diffuser, if you use distilled water, it will help protect the life of the diffuser. And don't use um, essential oils and humidifiers, especially if they do not call for essential oils, because they will break down that plastic in those. Uh, so the first oil we're going to talk about is in the Everyday Oil Kit. It's called lavender. And lavender is great to use uh, topically. Uh, it's very good for the skin. It also has great aromatic benefits. So you can diffuse it for a calming and comfortable scent. You can also unwind by adding a few drops to Epsom salts for a nighttime bath. You can add it to carrier oil and apply it directly to the skin to promote re relaxation, especially before bedtime. You can also um, add it to your favorite shampoos, lotions, body washes, and skincare products. You can also add two to three drops to a natural, natural deodorant to have a floral lavender scent. Um, so just some do-it-yourself products you can do with lavender. You can make uh, wool dryer balls and you can use that as fabric softener. You can also put it in mascara, it helps to help with the uh, eyelashes. And you can also put it in face and body, body creams. And the next one is peppermint. 
Peppermint, if you put two drops in a capsule with the carrier oil, you can take it up to three times daily, and that's going to help uh, promote digestive health. Also, if you have any kind of acid, um, the peppermint's going to really be good for digestive support. You can also add it to your favorite drink or recipe. I love making brownies and putting peppermint in my brownie mix. It makes a really good peppermint flavor. You can also add two to three drops to your power meal or your pure protein complete shake. Um, also mixed with chocolate milk for a satisfying uh, meal replacement shake. You can also put it in a capsule with carrier to help with the digestive tract. Um, add it to herbal tea to soothe your stomach. It can also support performance during exercise. And for recipe, uh, excuse me, recipes that call for peppermint, you can substitute one eighth of a teaspoon of peppermint oil for that extract in those recipes. Um, my favorite use for peppermint is before exercise. I use peppermint um, to help me get an energy boost when I'm going to the gym. And I also like to bring it uh, in a roller ball with some carrier oil and apply it while I'm at the gym. Um, it's also great after exercise for soothing muscles and just any kind of tension. The next one is lemon. You can put two to three drops in a gel capsule with the carrier oil up to three times daily. You can add it to your drinking water. Make sure with any of the citrus oils that you're using glass or stainless steel because they will um, corrode the plastic. Uh, plastics have petrochemicals in them, which the citrus oils attack. So you want to make sure that with those citrus oils, you're drinking it out of glass or stainless steel. Uh, but I love drinking lemon in my water. It's really great for just uh, the flavor and just the natural flavoring for that. You can also enhance recipes especially like chicken, it's really good for that. And it includes the naturally occurring constituent limonene. So limonene is very good for the immune system. Um, you can also add two to three drops to a bowl of water to help wash fruits and vegetables after you buy them. You can also use it to um, remove sticky residue from any kind of products, um, like a natural goo gone, you can use it for that. And you can also apply it in your laundry, especially for whites, to help brighten them um, and to help remove stains. Lemon is also a key ingredient in Thieves, Ninja Red, and Inner Defense, so it's great for the immune system. The next one is Frankincense. You can apply it topically two to four drops to the skin. Dilution is not required on this one unless you have sensitive skin. You can also inhale it aromatically or diffuse up to one hour three times daily. You can diffuse or inhale for increasing spirituality and inner strength to help lift mood and inspire balanced emotions. It also may help smooth the appearance of healthy looking skin. Um, it is also the key ingredient to many of our skincare products, including our wrinkle cream, brain power, awaken, highest potential, and forgiveness. And it also incur, uh, includes the naturally occurring constituent alpha pinene, which is great for emotional support. And it's also useful for massage after physical activity. Um, frankincense is one that I use under my moisturizer every day. I've noticed it's really helped to fade my acne scars and just help with my um, complexion overall. And then the next one is RC. Um, RC, you can apply topically. One drop of RC with one drop of carrier oil to the chest, neck, and throat for soothing. You can also um, inhale it directly from the bottle or diffuse for up to one hour, three times daily. Um, apply two to three drops to the skin and then use a warm, wet towel on top as a hot compress and massage into chest and throat. Also, you can apply it to a bowl of hot steaming water. Place your head over the bowl and put a towel over your head and inhale the steam, that's called tinting. Really good for respiratory support if you're battling something to do that. You can also rub RC on feet and chest before exercise. Eucalyptus is really good to help relax the mind, mind and body. You can also diffuse RC at bedtime for a comforting aroma or add to a carrier oil to create a spa-like atmosphere. And RC was one of my favorites whenever I was dealing with a lot of respiratory issues for my son. Um, when he was an infant, it was one I used on him every day just to help support um, healthy lung function and help with that respiratory system. And the next one is Copaiba. And you can use Copaiba in a gel capsule with the carrier oil up to three times daily. You can also add it to almond or coconut milk, add it to drinking water, tea, or honey. 
Cope Iba has a pleasant, <laughs> complex taste, and when taken internally, sure. it can promote wellness. You can take it daily as a dietary supplement or mix three to four drops in a teaspoon of honey as part of a healthy regimen. Um, it also includes the naturally occurring constituents beta caroline and alpha humulene. Copaiba is a key ingredient in our products like Deep Relief, um, and it's also really good just for healthy inflammation um, to help also with circulation, and Copaiba is just really great for muscular support as well. And the next one's purification. You can use purification topically, dilute one part purification to one part carrier oil. Um, you could also diffuse it up to 15 to 30 minutes every three to four hours or directly inhale it from the bottle. You can put purification in cotton balls or tissues and put in air vents. You can add it to a wet washcloth and put it in the clothes dryer to help with laundry. So I use cloth dryer balls and I put purification on those and that's what I use for my um, fabric softener and also to help my laundries to smell better. Um, purification I just find really helps with like mildew, smell, and just really weird odors. You can also add it to a cotton ball and place in diaper pails. Um, also, you can put it down the disposal in your sink. Um, you can also put it in trash cans just to help neutralize odors. You can diffuse purification with lemon to create an inviting scent. And then you can also add it to Young Living's bath and shower gel base or add four drops to Epsom salts for a soothing bath. You can add to carrier oil to complement soothing and relaxation in a foot massage. And the next one is Pan Away. Pan Away you can apply topically. You can dilute one drop of Pan Away to one to four drops of carrier oil and apply to the desired area. You can also apply two to four drops to an Epsom salt bath. Um, really great for after exercise to just help the body recover uh, properly. You can also inhale it directly or diffuse it for an invigorating scent. Um, you can apply it topically or use it in an Epsom salt bath to help relax and create a spa-like atmosphere. Combine with the carrier oil and apply to temples, neck, back, or shoulders for a stimulating experience. You can also place two drops in your hands, rub together and inhale deeply, or add to whipped coconut oil for a pleasant balm that can be used after stretching or exercise. Uh, keep pan away in your gym bag and use it for after a workout for a refreshing scent and a cooling sensation. Uh, I have actually been training for a half marathon. I'm running okay. the end of this month. So Pan Away has been great to use on my knees every day just to help support uh, my knees and help them recover from all of the extra activity I've been doing. And the next one is Thieves. Um, Thieves has been around since the 16th century and has been known to help support the immune system and help with all kinds of um, immune system issues. So you can place two drops in a gel capsule with eight drops of carrier oil. You can take that up to three times daily. You can also add it to smoothies, applesauce, yogurt, juice, or knees or red. Um, it can contribute to wellness when taken as a dietary supplement. It also supports healthy immune function. Um, Thieves contains eucalyptus, also um, helps with a healthy uh, respiratory system when taken as a dietary supplement. You can add one drop of Thieves to two drops of orange essential oil for a warm homemade apple cider. And Thieves is also excellent for cleaning and degreasing. It can also be found in our Thieves household cleaner and other Thieves products that we have. The next one is Digize. And Digize, if you place two drops in a gel capsule and take before each meal, it's gonna really help support digestive system. Um, or if you overeat, like I do sometimes, <laughs> Digize is really good rubbed on your stomach to help with that discomfort. Um, you can also add two to three drops to drinking water or honey. And when traveling abroad, Digize is great to take along to help with any kind of weird diets that you're having while you're traveling. Also, you can use Digize with every meal to help support a daily wellness regimen. Or combine two drops of Digize with one drop of peppermint to help with a pleasant, stimulating aroma. Digize is also an ideal complement for our nutritional supplements such as Comfortone and Essential Zymes, which help support digestive system. And the bonus oil that comes in our kit is Stress Away. Stress Away is a normal solution created to combat normal stresses that creep into everyday life. It may be an important part of your daily regimen. 
Stress Away is also available as a convenient roll-on, and it contains the ingredients copaiba, lime, cedarwood, vanilla, okatea, and lavender. And you'll also get some samples in your starter kit of Ninja Red. Ninja Red is a healthy daily supplement that you can use. It's created with exotic fruits, um, also infused with essential oils to help absorption. Its balanced ingredients make Ninja Red a whole body nutrient infusion and may help with uh, immune system support and also wellness support. It contains powerful ingredients and antioxidants. Um, it has the wolf berries, which are native to China and are touted for many health benefits, uh, very high in antioxidants. Helps to support normal cellular function, good health and overall wellness. Also supports normal eye health, can help against oxidative stress, very antioxidant. And it also helps to energize, fortify and revitalize. Um, so, a way that you can get your premium starter kit, the most popular way is to get a wholesale membership. For only $160, you're going to get a premium starter kit. It's going to come with all 11 essential oils that we talked about today. Also, it'll come with a home diffuser, um, which retails for $100 of itself. So, it's a very good um, buy. If you were to buy everything individually, it comes out to about $300. So over 50% off discount to get this kit all together. It has everything that you need to get started on your wellness journey. Um, it also will have samples and accessories. Um, like I said, the Ninja Red samples will be in that as well. So uh, like I said, the premium starter kit is definitely the best way to get started. $160. Make sure to contact the person that invited you today for their sponsor ID so that they will get the credit for that. And then we also have an optional uh, program called Essential Rewards. And Essential Rewards, it's free to join, it's free to cancel. You can start it and stop it at any time directly in your Young Living uh, virtual office. So what is Essential Rewards? It is a generous Essential Rewards program. It allows you to earn points and cash back for your free monthly auto ship order. And you can redeem those points for free products at any time. You can also change your order every month. And you can also change your ship date each month. The order minimum is 50 PV. Of course, you can order more than that, but you're going to get cash back on all of that every month when you purchase on Essential Rewards. Um, you're also going to experience reduced shipping charges. So the standard shipping is going to be $6.99. Um, it's normally around $9, so you're going to save a couple dollars on shipping. For months 1 through 6, you're going to earn 10% cash back. Months 7 through 12, you'll earn 15% cash back. And after 12 months, you're going to earn 20% cash back. You can also get one skip month per year at uh, your request. You can cancel at any time. Um, also, if we have monthly promotions and Essential Rewards uh, customers will get an extra oil or product each month just for their Essential Rewards uh, program. So your monthly promotions, you can really maximize those by using Essential Rewards. Um, to sign up for Essential Rewards, just go to your virtual office and click on Essential Rewards or contact member services for more help. Um, so we have some oils that are, are after the kit items, you know, oils that we like to use or our first purchases. A couple of those, um, the first one I got was Citrus Fresh. Really great to um, help diffuse for just getting rid of odors and helping uplifting the environment. Also great to drink in your water. The next one's Aroma Ease. And I was given Aroma Ease when I went to the farm in Utah. Um, really helped me with altitude sickness and it's really good to um, help combat nausea especially if you're like riding roller coasters or on airplane uh, aroma ease is great for that also helps support digestive system and the next one is orange orange is another one that's really high in antioxidants it is one of our citrus oils um, you can enhance flavors of food with that lemongrass is really great um, just to use as an outdoor spray um, to help just with the, uh, you know, being outside and just helping with little pes pesky critters, help keep those away. Mm -hmm. uh, it may also help support the digestive system and overall well-being. And then tea tree or melaleuca is very um, great for skin care. It's found in a wide spectrum of skin products and spa treatments. can help with the appearance of skin. Valor is great to increase strength of feeling and courage. Uh, it's one of my favorites to use anytime I'm going to have a stressful situation. I like to use Valor 
especially before I teach classes. <laughs> and mm -hmm. uh, Deep Relief is another great one for after exercise. Another one I use on my knees daily when I'm running so much. Um, it also comes in a convenient roll-on, so you can apply it any time. And then lastly, Thieves Cleaner. Um, Thieves Cleaner has replaced all of my household cleaners. Um, I like that I'm a busy mom and I just have to carry around one bottle with me. I don't have to switch my cleaners. I can clean my toilets, my bathtubs, uh, my sinks, my mirrors, all with Thieves Cleaner. So it really saves me time. It's also non-toxic, um, very highly effective, and helps just to clean the whole home. There's also some other ways that you can use Young Living. You can make bath salts. Um, you can make uh, Sweet Dreams cream. You can make homemade lip balm. Um, also massage oils, body butters, and sugar scrubs. So there's lots of ways you can use Young Living products. Um, when you order through us, we also have a Facebook support group that we will add you to um, that will help with lots of support and any questions you may have. Like I said, um, we are here anytime if you have any questions. This will be recorded, so we'll be able to post the link later and you can rewatch it. But now I'll just take any questions anyone might have. So if you have any questions, just type them out on the screen and we'll get to those now. This is your time. <laughs> <laughs> and you can take a, a minute to breathe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you went through that so fast, but it's like, you know, you know what I mean. It was great. I enjoyed it. Was there any questions I didn't answer that popped up? Um, no. Does no. anybody have any questions? Other than if to, you're going to put on YouTube. To ask about... On your tooth? On YouTube. Oh, YouTube. Okay. About anything that you uh, might be struggling with, that you need help with, what oil might support a particular body system uh, that you're needing help with or whatever. Um, I, while you're thinking of your questions, maybe, <laughs> I'll just highlight on our raffle. Um, so far, uh, for those of you that are watching that are participating or might still want to participate in the raffle, we're not going to draw tonight. Lindsay, I'll ask your, answer your question in just a second. Um, we're going to draw um, maybe in the next week, so there's still time to get spots left, and I'll go over that some more in a minute. Lindsay had a question, Lindsay yeah. Turner. Mm -hmm. um, and Lindsay, can you write it again? Because I remember part of it, but not all of it. <laughs> Noogie with Lindsay. She's still here. Something about using water in the diffuser. What types of water or? Oh, um, I like to use distilled water. Distilled um, water. Distilled is best, I think, because it doesn't leave the residue. I find I don't have to clean my diffuser as much if I use distilled water. Okay. So that's the best one. Do you always recommend distilled water in the diffuser was her question. Okay. Yes, yes. I do. Okay. You can use tap water, but make sure if you do that you're cleaning it out each time because you're going to have that build up. Yep. <laughs> I don't have any more questions myself. Okay. Well, if anyone has any questions, feel free to contact us. And thank you for watching. Thank you, Kayla. You're welcome. Got it, she says. Okay. So I'm just going to go over real quick about the raffle. I still have, um, here you pull this down. <laughs>